organizers are still in the process of getting the shop up and running. Designers have been coming by and dropping off their goods like this homemade jam. I'm being told 32 small businesses so far participating in this project. These are the chunky knit jackets. Ariel Sanders showing us some of her most popular items. Made by hand, I sit and knit all day. She's been in business eight years. Made some ornaments for your Christmas tree. And is finally seeing a dream realized. Just being here and wanting to be uh, in downtown Raleigh as far as having my stuff in the shop means everything. Sanders is just one black owned small business owner jumping at the chance to be a part of the Black Friday market pop up shop. It's located at the corner of Hargett and Salisbury streets. The store is sort of a cooperative. The advocacy group Black Dollar NC is spearheading the project. The CEO taking a vacant storefront and creating a space where small businesses, many black owned, can thrive during a dark time in our economy. We'll make this space lively where folks know where it is, know what we're doing, uh, and they'll continue to support those business owners. Through supporting this store, you're supporting multiple business owners. Sanders is a second generation small business owner and putting her personal touches on the space. During George Floyd riots, my mom's shop was basically devastated when those busted out, all her shop stuff was gone. The mural sending a message of solidarity then and now. There's so many good people here, so many good allies here, and we just wanted to put that message out that we are all in this together. Black Friday market will officially open on December 18th, but there is a chance to get a sneak peek. There will be an open house tonight in downtown Raleigh from 6 o'clock until 8. In Raleigh, Elena Athens, ABC 11 Eyewitness News.